Yo, 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 yo. Thank you for tuning in to my channel. This is Gunning with Javo. My name is Javo, of course. Uh, I'm from Chicago. You saw the thumbnail, though, you know. Today, we're going to be um, doing some cleaning of the Taurus. Taurus G3, to be exact. Um, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a budget gun, but I always... I always... Um, I guess you could say... I like budget guns, you know. It, 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 be, it be sometimes, you know, you ain't got to go out there and spend... You know, eight hundred dollars on a gun. You know what I'm saying? You can get you you can get a a, a nice one for like three hundred, five hundred type shit like that. You can get a, a, a real nice one that's just as reliable. You know, don't, you you ain't gotta fall into the trap. Like, you know, you you know how how like other people do. You know, you ain't gotta fall into that trap. But I will say, though, some of them them higher them higher guns them them of us do go crazy. I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, but yeah, man, you know what? Let's get into this video. So, you know, before we start cleaning this mud, you know, first we got a safety first, safety first. No bullets in the bag. None in the chamber as well, you know. Make sure we, you know, yeah. All right, now we can, you know, we can start, we can start cleaning. We can, we, we can clean and talk. We can clean and talk. So that's how you take that off. I, you know, when you um, when you when I slid that slide back, I do it again. I do it again. Yeah, it's just be blowing me sometimes. There you go. Shit. So when you slide it back, you just slide this slide back a little bit like that. Make sure your finger is not in there. You, it will get caught. And you see this right here? Right here? You can pull that down. When you pull it down, you let go, pull the trigger, and you push the back. Which is the, that's how you get that off. That's how you get that off. So, you know, let's get into it, you know, so... As I said, this is Gunning with Javo. My name is Javo. Um, from Chicago. From Chicago, Illinois. You know how you know how you know how it go. Beautiful city, man. Beautiful city. But yeah, man. You know, this is my first video. It's just you know talk about like some background and shit. Um, I always been interested in guns. Always been interested. Oh wait, before I um. Uh, Right, we we'll get into that another day. So yeah, I always been interested in guns a lot since I was younger, bro. Like, like I had a crazy addiction to it. Like I remember, like when motherfuckers taught me how to, how to, how to, how to basically like make like a little paper gun. Like I, I'd be, I'd be, um, I'd be in the living room, you know, fake, fake playing. Like I'm a, like I'm a cop and I'm shooting the bad guys, shit like that. You know, it it, it it was fun. It was fun. I love I, lo I loved action movies that, that 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 involved guns in it. I loved all this, all all that shit. All that shit was exciting to me. All of it, literally. Damn. Yeah. Fuck it. I'm using um the hops. Hops bore cleaner. But yeah, man, like, I always loved guns. And I remember, uh, and, and it, it, it wasn't until, and then, you know, obviously, I mean, I'm in Chicago, so, you know, I gotta wait. You know, you gotta wait till you're 21. You know, I was thirsty as hell when I first got, you know, you know, like, basically, like, when I turned 21. Turned 21, and, and, and it, it was over with. It was over with. Like, I was so I was so motherfucking happy, man. I was like, I'm, I was like, man, okay, I'm finally able to go to the bars, strip clubs, type shit like that. But the most important, but the most thing that I was really excited for, excited for, was being able to get my gun finally. 
That was the most thing I was excited for. And then I don't remember like I went over my oh oh over my I went over my friend crib. His ass got to the ass. They had like two of them. I'm like, oh yeah, I got it. I need that. I need that. I was on his ass. I was on his ass, I promise you. Cause his ass, like that's when I was like, you know, I gotta see if like get my guns and shit like that. You know, cause I'm like, man, this, this motherfucker really got them bitches, like. He really got them bitches, like. <laughs> Yeah, man, like, so, first time the guns, they, well, when I, as since I was younger, basically, fucking, um, I got my, okay, so, I, I'll admit this, I got my first gun just because I was feeling, um, a little salty, I was a little blue, you know what I'm saying, I, like, that was my only reason I got my, I got my first gun, the only reason. You know, basically the story behind that is, you know, I went to, um, I was supposed to go to this graduation, right? I was supposed to go to this graduation. Ended up, ended up not going. Why I didn't go? Because I was told I had a ticket to it. Was told I had a ticket, ended up finding out I didn't have no goddamn ticket. So it wasn't no way in hell I was gonna wait in the car. Cause we already there. We already there. Wasn't no way in hell I was gonna wait in the car and wait for motherfuckers to get done with the graduation. No. I'm bet I'm bet, you know what? I'm gone. I'm finna go to I'm finna go to Dick's. Dick's Point Goods. That's where I got my first gun from. It was the Taurus Millennium PT PT eleven. Got my first gun from that. I was I I, I was I was debating though because it was like so I okay so I only got the Taurus PT eleven because at the time I'm like man I got I got like I had like three hundred dollars and that Taurus PT was like maybe like two twenty maybe like yeah maybe like two twenty two fifty at the most maybe so I'm like yeah man let me get that. Got that, but you know, of course, you know, Illinois, I gotta wait, I gotta wait, um, yeah, I had to wait 72 hours, I had to wait 72 hours. It was cool, though, I I, I, I promise you, I was thirsty as hell to get that motherfucker, thirsty as hell to get that motherfucker, and, you know, when I finally got it, straight to the range, straight to the range. I had no, cause I, I I had never um I had never been to the gun range for that. Never been to the gun range. And, and also you gotta remember, like I said, I had just turned twenty one, so I was ready for everything. But yeah, I had never been to the gun range for that. So I went to the gun range, started shooting. I, I, I'm just shooting. I don't even know how to fucking. I, I don't even know how to fucking shoot. I'm gonna keep it a hundred with you. I did not know how to shoot. I was just in that motherfucker death. I was just in that motherfucker desk, just pulling the trigger. Honestly. Just and, and, but bullets was cheap around this time. This was this, I'm talking this is pre-COVID. I'm 28 right now. This is pre-COVID. Bullets cheap as hell. I mean like you get a pack of you you get a a box of 50 bullets for what? You getting it for uh, Twelve, fifteen dollars. So I ain't, I ain't getting no fuck. I ain't getting no fucks at all. I'm going there, just, just dumping, just dumping the mag, dump, dump, dump. Unfortunately, I ain't got that gun no more. You know, I ended up selling it. You know, I forgot what I, I forgot what I bought after I sold it. I forgot what you know. I should I probably should have showed this before I started cleaning it first. But yeah, it's more clean though, you know. See it, see if you can see up in there. I forgot what I bought when I when I sold it. So sold that gun. 
fucking um yeah sold that gun and then I remember I I had I I I used um if you don't know it's this app called Arm Arms List basically people you know they you know you you know what Arms List is you know what Arms List is if you don't go check it out go check it out you can probably get you know better deals on there than you know going to the the actual gun stuff you can probably get better deals on that but yeah I ended up uh, linking up with this dude from there off the app I mean off the website and, and and he the one that really you know he taught me how to shoot then it was some other mug cause I'm left handed for any of y'all that don't know I'm left handed and so I used to always shoot with my fucking right but, but I used to always shoot with my right like always, I don't know why. Don't ask me why. I do not know. I used to always shoot my right hand. Like my my right hand will always be my fucking shooting hand. But I remember I went to this one gun range and dude was like, "You left handed?" I'm like, "Yeah." He like, "Make sure you're right." He like, "Shoot with your left." Start shooting my left. Ain't got much better. Much, much, much better. The only thing I regret. Before is that like I didn't really put in the practice as much as I should have, you know. Like I should have been like I, I didn't should have been going, you know. I didn't should have been going to the range then like every weekend at least twice at, at, at least. At least two weekends out of the month. At least. But I wasn't. You know. I was not, you know. I was not thinking about that most of the time. But I was just like, you know, I got I got my gun and shit. And I was just thinking about just buying my other guns. I'm, I'm buying other guns and shit, you know. Instead of, instead of practicing with that one, instead of practicing and perfecting that one gun. My ass buying other guns, man. Fucking up. It's all cool, though, you know. You live and you learn. You live and you fucking learn. But yeah, man, so. But that, that was fun. I promise you. It was, it, 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 it like, like. Like shooting back then, like pre COVID, was fucking amazing, man. Like I wish I would have took more advantage of it before these bullets got to this price that they at now. Like I wish I would took advantage. I wish I would have took more advantage of it. But you know, I didn't. I ain't gonna beat myself up over it. They ain't what we here for. All good vibes on, on this channel. I promise you. You know, we ain't finna be negative in this motherfucker. No, um, what's the, what's the word? The negative Nancy's or something like that? I think that's the word. We ain't finna be doing that. We ain't finna be doing that here. Not on, not, not on this channel. We ain't not finna do that. You know, on, on, on this channel, the, the, the most thing I care about is that, you know, motherfuckers try. Try. That's it. You know, and then shit, if, it, if it, anybody from, from the Chicago area, man, that, um, that see this video, Man, you wanna link up, man? We can go to the range anytime, bro. I promise you. I'm free. I'm I'm, I'm damn near free. I'm, I'm damn near free all day, every day. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. So basically, as I'm cleaning this gun, um, I should have been explaining it more, but. I should have been explaining it more you know, actually it's on y'all so you know um let me look let me I, I, I'll show you in a minute so this the this the bore right here this the bore cleaned that I showed that to y'all this the slide cleaned the inside of that 
See? Look how shiny. Uh, but this is just the cleaning. This is just the cleaning. We ain't even, um, we ain't even oil it yet. We ain't even oil it yet. Clean this. And you clean the front, the uh, frame. It's a power on frame. Gotta clean that. Gotta clean that, man. So we done with this. We done with it. Don't need it no more. So, okay. I don't know, but you know, I had the cleaner and the oil for this. For um, Sudaloo. I, I, I love shooter I love shooter lube. I love shooter lube. I love shooter lube. I love it. Love it. Love it. But ran out the cleaner. Ran out of the cleaner. So right now, that's why I got the hops cleaner. Because you know you gotta order the uh shooter lube. So let's uh, wipe our hands off a little bit from the cleaner. So we can start oiling this mud up. You know, you oil your gun up, you know, so it won't, you know. You can, like, like everything, you want everything to be smooth, really. You want everything to be smooth. And just in case anybody got, got the question, this is not my, this is not my carry gun. This is not my carry gun. My carry gun, you guys will all see soon. I will be making, I, I, I will be dropping that video another week. But right now, we just focusing on this one. Um, yeah, right now we just focusing on this one. But, but yeah, man, so. Thank y'all for tuning in, man. You know, this, this, this is my what I done redid this video like three, four times. I promise you, like all right, right now. I've been just so nervous. I don't want to mess up, you know. But you know, it is what it is. We all meant to mess up. This we just gone. Put it. I saw. I saw. I saw. I saw about this in, the, in one of the other videos. I'm like, man, how the hell I'm supposed to all this like for real? Like, look at this. Put on their finger and just did like this. Got to it. Oh, I right, bet. Then you want oil inside of here. So you want oil this over that. Or the outside right here, so that slide can be nice and smooth. You know, you don't want no shit being all raggedy. You know what I'm saying? That one's gonna be smooth. You know, just like how you lotion yourself up in the morning, like how you take your shower. That's basically what you're doing with with, with your with your fire. Huh? You lotioning this motherfucker up. You know, as kids, you know how your how, how your how your mama had you go outside with a whole lube of fucking no with a whole um, fucking container of grease on your motherfucking face, Vaseline on your face. That's how, yeah. I mean, you ain't gonna do it like you ain't, you ain't gonna do your you gonna do your fire. Please do not do your fire like that. Do not do fire like that. I'm just saying, you know, just like how you you know just like how, how your body need to be ordered, you know the. Find on the oil too, you know. You paid the money for it, my dog. Take care of it, right? All right, so put this back together. You don't sit that like that. Sit on top of the. Then you gonna put this in, put this in like this.
you're gonna sit it. So, I don't know if you can see it really, but you see it? Sit it like that. All you gotta do, see this? So this, these little rubbers, that's what this is for. So you sit it, you just slide it basically. You know, like I did it earlier. I mean, we can probably like wipe these down too. They're a little dirty. I ain't finna disassemble it. Like, some people do to like disassemble it all the way. I'm not finna be doing all that. I'm finna just get up in there like that, clean that like that so we can just look a little nice. You know, we ain't gotta go overboard with it. You know. But yeah, man, you know, and that's it, that's it, smooth, baby, just like butter, there you go, you know, hey, but uh, yeah, man, thank, thank y'all for tuning in, my first video, I will be posting another video with me, with me, with me soon as. I ain't gonna lie to you. I only get a box of 50. Cause Billy's expensive. And I got another video that I'm gonna have for y'all soon. Another video of me going to uh I I I I'll tell y'all about it next time. I'll, I'll tell y'all about it next video. I'll tell y'all about the next video. But yeah, I got another video coming soon. So you know I need y'all to so all my uh, all my bullets, I got I'm trying to preserve them for that. But yeah, man, I only use a box of 50 for it. When I um, went to the gun range, I will be posting that video as well with this one. But yeah, man, thank y'all for tuning in, man. As I said, this is Gunning with Javo. You know, hope everybody have a, have a blessed day, have a safe day. Stay armed, stay ready. You know, got to keep it on you, man. You know, it's a lot of crazy things happening in this world, man. But peace. <laughs>